What is up, guys? It's Romano here, back with another American Truck Simulator video. And today, boys and girls, we are here in American Truck Simulator for the first time in a while, and we do have the oversized load um, sides and the flags on. But you know what? We're not going to be doing an oversized haul today. So, uh, let's get into the video, shall we? But anyways, um, we are taking a load from Walbert to Newport. So, or no, sorry, we're going to be taking a load from Truckee to Newport, Oregon, and Oregon is the new map, and as you can tell, I've explored a lot of it, which does include that route, and that route does get a little goofy, it does get a little interesting, so it's definitely going to be a fun, fun, fun uh, haul, so let's start up the engine here, perfect, windshield wipers are on, we're going to turn those off, now let's turn on the secondary engine, or not secondary engine, but just let's, you know, alright, now what we're going to do is we're going to put it into first gear, Perfect, let's just push it up a little bit. Now we're going to do is we're going to turn the hazards on real quick. Put the beacons on since we're backing up to a trailer. Alright, let's go into reverse. Gear 1, perfect. Let's back it up. Alright, let's start turn here. I'm not really sure. Alright, perfect, yep. And we're getting it pretty well over here. There's a cop right there, not... That's kind of goofy. Oh, yeah, he's just in the side there. Alright, anyways, perfect. Let's get this line up. Pay attention here. Left mirror looks really well there. We're going to see the right mirror coming in just a second. Perfect. That left mirror looks good, and the right one looks good, too. And stop. Perfect. Let's put the parking brake on. See how we did backing up. That's pretty good. Here we go. Now let's put the trailer on. Here we go. Perfect. Now, as you can tell, we're going to look at the route here real quick. So we're going down the 80, up the 5, all the way up into the five again we're gonna go around actually so we're not gonna be taking the left way which i would rather take not gonna lie i think maybe maybe what we should do is yeah because this is a fun route right here it's nice it's like very curvy and stuff it's very like really interesting but honestly maybe we'll go with this one yeah you know what we'll do so we'll go the one that it wants us to go all right anyways let's get this out perfect release parking brake put into first i take the beakers off. Turn off the hazards. Perfect. We're going to take a right turn out of this area here. Alright, let's cut the wheel to the left. We're going to have to use a little bit over here. We're going to kind of use the other side. And we are going to go to the repair shop real quick. Let's back up so that we didn't make that turn. Not going to lie. Alright, let's put into first here. We just kind of had to reverse real quick. Alright, what we're going to do here is we're going to cut... We're going to turn it here. We're going to kind of take this one wide. Because of how we have to turn here. Getting out of here. Perfect. Alright, let's get into second here. Alright, we made that turn perfect. Get into third. Oh, yellow light. We're just going to go for it. Oh, it's red. We don't have time to slow down. Not going to lie. All right. Let's just go real quick. Nobody saw that. Perfect. We made that. All right. Now we're going to do is we're going to take a right turn. You know we're going to do is we're going to back up. We're going to back up into this here. So we're going to turn the hazards on and put the beakers on real quick. Probably wouldn't regularly do this, but you know what? Gotta do what you gotta do. Because I don't think we'll make that turn and then be able to get out very easily. Alright, let's shift up a gear because we want to kind of turn very fast here. All right, for the mo we had that for the most part, but that's okay. Try this again here. All right, perfect. All right, now let's just send it real quick. There we go, perfect. All right, back straight up into the little area over here. Perfect, perfect. Look at that. That is perfection right there at its finest. All right, let's put into neutral, put the parking brake on. We're going to just go into the service area real quick. 2461, we're going to have to pay because, you know, we had um, troubles from the other load there. 
now we're going to do is we're just going to see what we have here. So we have really nothing we can upgrade. Well, we could actually upgrade this, but the engine, but that doesn't really do that much. Besides, I'd rather buy something. Let's look at what this does here. This kind of... Is this, what does this do? This kind of just turns it down really quick for the heavy loads, and we want to keep that. We don't really have any new paint jobs or anything, so what we're going to do is we're just going to take off... Oh, look at the bump. We have new bumpers, but that's nothing special. We're going to take off the oversized load sticker. Then we're going to take off the flags, too, since we're not hauling an oversized load. Really no reason to have them on if we are. Perfect. And we're not going to change anything else here. All right, perfect. We're just going to... 42 bucks, I think, down the drain. Yeah, we're going to lose. All right, so start up. All right, perfect. Let's turn the lights on. All right. All right, there we go. Perfect. And we do have to grab gas real quick after this, too. That's okay. All right, let's get out of here. Don't see anybody coming. Alright, perfect. Let me just pause it real quick. Alright. And we're going to do a lot of time lapses throughout the video, so just be prepared for that. Perfect. We're going to take a right turn in the gas station here. Perfect. This is actually a perfect place for it. Alright, let's just try not to hit the sign there. That would be very nice. All right, we'll worry about that in a second here. We're just going to fill up on gas real quick. All right, perfect. Oh, let's not start out in ninth. Let's go to back to first. Perfect. All right, we're going to kind of have to cut it up. We don't want to hop over that. Let's not scrape the sign either. All right, perfect. We made it out there. I don't know why he stopped. Not going to lie. All right, perfect. Now we're going to take a left onto the highway or the freeway real quick. Watch the right left mirror there. Perfect. All right, and we are off onto the freeway here. Finally getting out. We have a 12, 13-hour journey to go through real quick. So, oh, boy, we're just going to go for it real quick. All right, perfect. Let us go. Should be a fairly easy load to haul since it isn't. it's only a 54-foot or a 42. Um, and the fact that it is, you know, not an oversized load is going to make it easier. So, Perfect. We have a thousand miles on the distance here, and it's only 647 miles away, so we definitely have a lot to go, which is very nice. Oh, we're going too low in the RPMs there. We really want to shift at 21 to 2200 um, RPMs, and then we want to downshift at like 17. So yeah, that's kind of how I roll with this truck. Just kind of depends on the truck here. Some trucks are at 20 and 15, but, you know, it kind of just depends. All right, let's get in the left lane here. All right, let's shift that. Shift up. Got to be careful here since there is road work. Oh, boy, that was kind of close. Not going to lie. We kind of went around there. All right, perfect. All right, we're probably going to have to downshift up this hill. And, no, we're going to keep it. We're going to keep it. Yeah, we got that. Perfect. Let's watch the right mirror. It's in the right lane here. 
Alright, we're pretty much coasting right about now, I think. Yeah, we are. There we go, perfect. Let's get in the left lane. Perfect, and we're going to start going back up this hill right about now. We're going to bring it into 18th gear, surprisingly. We're going to 83 miles an hour, which isn't too bad. Probably shouldn't be going that fast, but that's okay. We're going to bring it down into 17. Yeah, we are coasting here, so pretty much no engine sound. No engine work needed right now. Very nice, that's for sure. Yeah, I'm literally coasting here. I'm, I don't even have to press the gas. Definitely very nice here. Oh, boy. he! I was going to, into the right lane there. Oh, we have to take this. Okay, we made that. Woo. That's why you got to pay attention to your GPS, boys and girls. Not going to lie. All right, now we're going in 16th. Now there's the engine required, man. There we go. Let's get in the middle lane here. Alright, let's shift into the left lane here. Perfect. We're in the 16th gear. There we go, perfect. See, now we're definitely getting this done here. We're doing pretty well on this job real quick. We're making good time. We're, we're 10 hours left. Not bad, perfect. We are going 65 miles an hour, which is just, a, I think the speed limit's 55 or 65, either. Probably, probably either or, but I'm not really sure. Way station, one mile ahead. Please pull in for a vehicle inspection. All right. Let's get into the right lane here. All right. We're going to go down a gear here. We're going to definitely decrease speed really fast here. 15 miles an hour speed. And we're going in at 30. So. Try not to downshift too fast. But we don't want to cause problems either. All right. We made it. Parking brake. 83,063 is our gross weight. Perfect. Have a safe journey. We're cleared. All right, perfect. Let's get into the right lane here. Try and get speed real quick. 25 miles an hour. We're going to cut in real quick. All right, that was kind of... We did kind of cut him off there, not going to lie. But, you know, that's okay. All right, perfect. Into 13th. Let's get into the left lane. Let's get an outside view of this thing, even though you can't really see it. Looking pretty nice. Alright, so our ETA is 1034, 1033 AM in the morning, which isn't that bad. Pretty good. So, you know, we're not that far off. There we go, there we go, there we go. We're in 62 miles an hour here. 64, we're in gear 15, alright, we're going to shift up to 16 real quick, 65 miles an hour, perfect, so guys, we're going to talk about my channel, so, basically, definitely, thing about my channel is that I'm busy with high school, I'm a, I'm a 14 years old, I'm a freshman in high school, and you know, I'm really focused on that, like, you know, I'm, I'm focused on my studies, obviously, but, I'm kind of focused in general, just like, you know, kind of friend group, like friends and stuff. You know, I'm not going to lie, being honest. And like, you know, I'm kind of awfully, like, definitely busy with that a lot of time. And like, 
I don't know, I just, like, I find, I can have time, but, like, I just don't. Like, I'm, that might sound bad, but, like, think about it this way. I'm texting people, right? Alright? I'm talking to them, and I'm making friends and all that stuff, being part of my friend group and all that. And think about me making videos, alright? It's, you guys are my friend group. This is a whole different friend group, a whole different side of me, right? And, like, I love this side of me, and I love making videos, and I love entertaining you guys and all that. And that's what's happening, alright? That's what I'm doing. Perfect, let's just watch out for that. Oh, dang, what was that? I think the police car just flipped. I'm not really sure. I couldn't really tell. But, anyways. So, I love making videos. And I am trying my best to make videos often. And I my goal was three every week. At the beginning of the um, school year. And I thought, and I was like, alright, I can think I can do this. I did three, and then I did two, and then I did one, and then I did two weeks off. A week off. Last week, I just uploaded two times. So... I think we're going to shoot for two videos, Monday and Friday, three if feasible, but yeah, and like, think about, okay, so like, I love making videos and stuff, right, and there's a whole other aspect of just me talking, sitting here, playing American Truck Simulator for you guys, um, it's not just me talking and playing, it's, there's a lot that goes on behind the scenes, and I'm sure you guys hear that, and I'm sure there's no little bit of, whoa, about that. But you guys probably don't know everything. You probably don't know exactly what happened. So, basically, I'm going to run through it since we have about, oh, nine more hours huh, game time. I'm kidding. Probably about, what, another 30 or so minutes? Yeah. Um, so, basically, with videos, you make the video, right? And before you even start recording the video, you have to prepare. You have to think about, what am I going to record today? And then you have to set it up, and then you have to set up your, you know, your uh, recording software, which is OBS for me, if you guys didn't know that. And then you have to set up your, you have to think out, what are you, what am I doing today? What, what video am I making? Then you have to do that, and then you have to plan out what you're doing inside, like, what game am I playing? Alright, that's the tough part. Farming Simulator, American Truck Simulator, Flashing Lights, Euro Truck Simulator, anything. Gold Rush, anything. Fortnite. Um, and then you find a game what you want, and then you think... What am I going to do inside of this game? So then you think of an idea to do in, say, Farming Simulator, like, I don't know, let's just pull out construction. And now that you have construction, you have to find the mods, the modifications for the game. And the mods, obviously, aren't very easy to find. Well, they're, they're fine. They're, you know, you can find them. It's just kind of tough to find them in your mod list. So, like, you find the mods, and you get the mods, and you have a good plan in your head, an idea in your head to figure out, what, what am I doing today? So now that I know what I'm doing, and I have an idea of what is going to happen in the video, and what I'm going to set up, then you get in the game, right? And you're in Farming Simulator, and you go to single player, and then you're like, create game, and you're like, I got to find the mods. So you find the mods, maybe you have a struggle finding a few, but you find them in the long run, right? Now that I have them, alright, and I'm starting up my game, and then you go in. And then there's, sometimes there's, you know, un... Then sometimes there's like un, um, like unpreventable problems that consist. So like, say a mod not working correctly, or the way you want it to work, or the way it's supposed to work. So now that this mod doesn't work, you have to find a substitute for the mod, or you have to completely get rid of the idea itself. And once you get rid of the idea itself, or find a new mod, then you have to start and make an idea, another idea, another plan. And just figure out an alternative to what you're doing, right? And now that you have an alternative to what you're doing, you then... when you have, Now that you have the alternative, then you have to get the mods and all that. And say, this time it works. It all works. You're in the game, right? You're chilling, alright? And you're ready, and you have all the mods. Now you buy, have to buy all the vehicles, and whoa, that's brush in the road. And you have all that there, and you're, you know, you're... Your, I was going to say brush, but that's the thing that was in the road, not that I'm doing. Alright, anyways. So now that you have all that, now you have to set up the, uh, the plan. You know, you, you, you know you're, you're, you're ready, right? You're ready and you're 
chilling and you're happy. Now you buy all the vehicles and you say, all right, so you hook up this trailer to this trailer and then you have to make the situation. And that takes God knows how long. And then now that you have that, right, then it's time to make the video. So you make the video, it's probably 20 minutes, you guys see. And then the preparation time is like 20, 10 to 45 minutes sometimes. And now that, you know, you did that, so that's 45 minutes, or let's just give it 20. 25 minutes before the video, 20 minutes to make the 20 to 30 minutes to make the video. This problem will probably be like 40. And then after you have that, then what you do is it's the post-production. So after you make the video, then you have to make the, you have to get the thumbnail, all right? You have to find what you're going to make as the thumbnail. You have to figure out what you're going to do with that. Now that you got what you're going to do with that, you have to set that up. And once you set that up, it might not look as good as you think it is. It's going to. Now that you get that picture and, you know, you figure it all out. Let's just say we got the picture. You have to find the angle. You have to fly. You have to do, you have to figure it out. And then now that you're all, you have that done, right? You have to get your thumbnail and you have to put it into Photoshop, which is a uh, photo editing software that I use. Now that you have that, it's in Photoshop, then you have to edit the photo and you have to make it look nice and you have to add text and you have to increase the brightness and you have to just find that happy medium with everything and find the right color and all that stuff. And now that you have that done, all right, finally you have that and then you have to edit the video. So once you edit the video, which is um, basically just cutting the video in random places, making a time lapse for some areas, now that you have that done, You know, now that you've edited everything and all that crap, and, you know, you've edited it, and then, that probably takes 10 to 20 minutes. Alright, we're going into the left lane, not the right one. And, after you have that done, then you have to render the video, which will probably take 10 to 30 minutes, depending on the day, and how, what, may, what, and how long the video is and everything. So, after that, and then the Photoshop, that'll take a good solid 10 minutes. So, the, the Photoshop take 10 minutes the thumbnail will take five ten minutes so let's just say 10 for photoshop 10 for thumbnail added on to our 30 or 50 minute or our let's just say hour right now because usually our videos probably 30 minutes 20 30 minutes long so we're just gonna go 30 to make sense um so like 30 minutes of you know idea making and all that stuff and now that you have that done you have an hour worth of planning you have an hour worth of planning and making the video, and then after, you have what? 20, then after that, think about this here. So, I, I just had to think real quick in my head. So, Photoshop 10, editing 30, we're gonna go with 35, so... 60 plus 10 is 70, and then 35 is 70 plus 35, that would be, that'd be 105, so now that you have 105, which is an hour and about, what, 35 minutes, that's an hour and 35, I think, right around there, alright, anyways, close enough, or hour 40, no, hour and 35 minutes, hour and 35 minutes, then you have to put it in, and then you have to make the title, and you have to do all that, which is like, you know, and then, you know, like, uploading the video to YouTube and stuff. That'll take another 20 minutes or so, so that's, that's about two hours in one video, and you know what, give or take, okay, so maybe it's an hour, okay, some days it can be an hour, some days, it, but it's between that, so think about an hour of and you guys only see, what, 20, 30 minutes of that, which is pretty crazy to think about. But we, you know, I do much, we all do, me, Spencer TV, Garrett Plays, The Squad, Gorilla Man, we all do more than you think we do. You guys see the 30 minutes, but you guys don't see anything, all the planning and stuff that comes into that. And if that didn't happen, then there wouldn't be a lot. And you guys, whoa! You guys wouldn't be able to see the video in general, and then you guys probably wouldn't be here. And, like, just imagine that. So, right lane only? What? Oh, we are in, uh, are we in Oregon? Tricks over 20,000 next right. That would be us. Alright, we're gonna turn in. 
But basically, there's way more that goes into it. So it's not just me making a 30 minute video. It's me spending more time, you know, all that stuff. So you guys just have to think about the fact that we don't, I don't just do this one thing here. It's not just me doing this or that. It's me doing a lot more than you think. And if I don't do videos, I'm, I apologize, I'm sorry. But there's more than you think there is in the videos, so. That's all. Oh, just so you know. Wait, are we done? 82709. Wasn't that like 80,000 seconds ago? Alright, anyways. So. There's a lot more than you think, and it's not just me making the videos. So, just don't get mad or at me or anything and just you know just think about what I have to do to make this video so like just think about the fact that you know there's more than you think there is it's not just not just me sitting here talking to you guys in my chair it's not just me sitting in this chair sitting on my butt making no that's not what it is it's more than that it's much more planning more creative so just you know you know, I'm just saying, you know, just, just like, just don't get mad at creators for not uploading. Any YouTuber knows what I'm going, going through that makes quality videos. And I make, I like to think I make decent quality videos that you guys enjoy. And if I don't, <laughs> tell me down there. Tell me what I'm doing wrong in the comments section. So anyways, seriously though. It's just like, you guys have to think about what happens and behind, just, and like, think about that hour. What could I have done during that hour? I could have been playing baseball, practicing. Um, I could have been doing something other than that. So, making videos for you guys. So, it's just that you have to think about what I'm using my time for. And definitely am using it for YouTube and all that stuff. But I am also have more. It's not just me sitting here behind the chair talking to you. I can't just do that for 24 hours. I would be dead. I wouldn't be very happy either. So, like, yeah, that's just kind of the concept of it, or, you know, that's kind of just what goes down in the YouTube world, if you know what I'm saying. But, yeah, you know, that was kind of a lot, but, you know. So yeah, just uh, just think about that, and you know, what we do here, what else YouTubers, just to be thankful for not only my videos, but all the other YouTubers' videos that come out, especially the Squad and Spencer TVs, and Gear Plays, because they all make very high quality videos, probably higher quality, definitely higher quality than mine, uh, Gear Plays, definitely, Gear, Spencer, Grant, the Squad, obviously, Spencer TV gear plays they all spend they spend a lot they make more videos than me they spend more time on their videos and they do they make higher quality videos and i'm gonna go out there and say that and you know what just gotta be honest with that but seriously thankful for what them and what they do because they do a lot of important stuff and i'm not complaining by the way saying this about youtube and how stuff works I'm just saying you know just don't get mad at me or other YouTubers for not uploading. And Garrett plays. He's in high school as well. He's he manages time. Maybe he manages time, his time better because he makes high quality videos. He makes a video about every day. So like just and such TVs in college. And I'm not exact. I think the squad's in. I'm not really sure where the squad is actually. To be honest, it's been a while since I talked to him. But regardless, they all spend way more time on the videos than me. So. Don't, like, say, oh, no, Mono, you have it so hard. Because I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying. They make better the videos than me. If you're going to do that, go to them. Because, you know. But. Yeah. Garrett plays Special TV and Squad. They're all very fabulous YouTubers. If you haven't already, go check them out. Links are down in the description. But yeah, go check them out. They make high-quality videos, better videos than mine. I'm my, I'm not saying my videos are very good either, but, you know, 
theirs are really good. Definitely very good, and they spend a lot of time in. Hard work goes in their channels, that's for sure. So, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, they're definitely better YouTubers than I am, even though... Um, what's his, uh, Garrett plays has less subscribers than me, doesn't mean he doesn't make higher quality videos. Oh, boy! I just pressed the map button. Doesn't mean he doesn't make higher quality videos. And slash... Ah! What are you doing, guy? You go into the right lane, then you go into the left lane. You cut me off in the left lane. Oh, my gosh, that was annoying. Alright, anyway, sorry about that. But, yeah. Uh, uh, what was I? I was on Garrett Place. He's a smaller YouTuber. He has less subscribers than me. Doesn't mean anything. I'm not saying that's a bad thing or at all. Obviously, you'd rather have more subscribers. Anyways, that's besides the point. Um, he makes higher quality videos. He's, I'd say he's a better YouTuber than me. And that's kind of tough. You know, I, I'm not going to lie. It's kind of tough to say that. But he's a better YouTuber and he makes higher quality videos. And... Go check him out. Just and he has less subscribers. So subscribers doesn't mean anything. Just because you have a hundred thousand subscribers, doesn't mean you're a good YouTuber. Well, I mean it, it means you're doing something right, but it doesn't mean you're a good YouTuber, a good person in general. You know, well respected individual. Garrett plays is obviously all of the above. Very respected, good guy, all that stuff. So is Spencer TV and the Squad, obviously. Um they're all great YouTubers. Spencer TV and the Squad are obviously better YouTubers. Uh, anyways, you know, I'm <laughs> Um, but, yeah, it's, uh, go check them out, alright, I honestly don't know where I was going with that, I kind of just want to say that, get that out there, because you know what, it's the truth, but anyways, okay, let's talk about something else, um, I'm tired, not gonna lie. Alright. <clears throat> I don't think we're gonna do a time lapse today, not gonna lie. You can bypass. Yes! Thank you, Oregon, for letting me bypass your way station. I hate it so much. Alright, we have three hours left on this job. Let's see how far we are in this video. We're 32 minutes, which honestly isn't bad. I thought it might be 40, but it's 30, so that's good. Oh, 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 you thought... Alright, I got bored. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> Sixty-five in the minimum. Oh no, our speed limit's sixty, but you know we're gonna go sixty-five or so. Gotta get there quickly, you know what I'm saying? Oregon's definitely very nice, though, as you can tell. Like, look at this place. It's definitely. I think it's one of. It's it's definitely my favorite state. Oregon by far. They did a very good job on this. Very um, it's very hyped up too, and I didn't think they were. They you know I didn't say. I'm not gonna say I didn't think, but. You know, it was, I definitely thought it'd be tough for them to live up to the expectations that they were giving out with the trailers and stuff. And they definitely exceeded what the trailers look like. These, it's definitely very amazing. So, good job to SES Software, American Truck Simulator, for, um, and thank you for making this. Definitely um, not a waste of money at all. Definitely it's well spent dollars. So, yeah. Into the right lane here. Clear to move over. Perfect. So, uh, yeah, we're going to move over for them just, you know, just because.
perfect. There we go. 16th here. This job is gonna pay us 20 grand. I know, right? That's it? No, but sir, it's not that bad, I guess. But we're gonna get 20 grand for this job, which isn't too bad. Uh, we're about halfway in fuel, I believe. And we are about two hours and 18 minutes away, which isn't bad. We're just going to keep it straight here. Can't see what's in front of you when you're doing this, so definitely have to be careful. Oh. Alright, that's it with thumbnails or screenshots. Perfect. That's probably going to be my thumbnail. Which was obviously wasn't that hard. That's a, it's a little different from farming simulator to American truck simulator, as I was talking about earlier. You know how thumbnails take a while, but still gotta edit the thumbnail either way. Anyways, Perfect. Let's go into the right lane. Yeah, we're going to go in the right lane here. And we're going to go up exit 233. Oh, boy. Oh! We just fully sent it into the ditch there. Not going to lie. All right. Let's see how much damage we have. One and one. That's not too bad. All right, let's shift it back down. I'm going to have to maneuver around this car here. It's not an invitation to go, by the way, smart one. Don't move, car. Well, if you wanted to back up, you know, that would be nice, but... Oh, look at that. Perfect. Let's cut the wheel. All right, we had to engage the parking brake there. Oh, we just went. All right, hopefully we didn't crash. Not really. All right, not really, he says. Perfect, works for me, I guess. All right, perfect, we made it, I guess. I guess. No, we made it.
See, even with if I don't see the um, RPMs, I can kind of just guess it now from the sound because I know this truck pretty well, which is really good. Haven't had it for too long. I think this is, yeah, this is the Ken yeah, definitely Kenworth. Not sure exactly how long I've had it. Oh, that's a red. Okay, we're just going to kind of have to go through that. Work. Let's shift up here. All right, so we have an hour and 27, so we're going to be basically going through the back roads of Oregon, which you guys probably are very excited to see. If you guys obviously love this game, but yeah. Five thirty-six p.m. where I am. Um, Eastern time. Five thirty-six Eastern. Date is the 21st. We're probably going to be uploading this uh, tomorrow, which is Monday. Then I'll see if I can get a video for Friday. I should be able to, but, you know. Yeah, I love driving these two-lane roads. These are very fun. Perfect. Let's just hug the yellow line. It looks really cool in the mirror if you hug it. It looks really cool in general if you hug the yellow line. About 50 minutes out. Definitely pretty close here. All right, we're gonna do something goofy. Oh, this is really not a good idea. This is kind of a blind drive, but that's okay. And it's a, you're not supposed to pass there, but that's okay. All right, let's just kind of pass this guy up too. We're gonna shift down into 15th right about now. Shift down again. Let's go left here. Let's catch the green, yellow light. All right, let's not catch the um, side of the road there. That'd not be good. All right, let's just get out of the way. We're, we're quick before we make ourselves too much of an embarrassment. What are you doing, kid? Oh my gosh. Let's just pretend we went to the right, and now we're going to go up. Perfect. All right, let's get this bread, boys. Right lane is ending. Let's get into the left here. Go over this bridge. Yep, 
This is gonna be a cool screenshot. Alright, that's it. Breaks, breaks, breaks. Another Walbert, tra Walbert trailer. Somehow we're supposed to take a left here? Oh, right here. I was gonna say, like, that is not a road right there. Let's get this perfect. That was, this is going to be a tough turn. Yeah, we're not going to make this on the right side of the road. We're in Newport. That's pretty cool. Stop sign here. Perfect. And take a left turn right up here. Supposed to cross this traffic. How am I supposed to just cross this traffic with no like light or anything? Oh, they're letting me go. Thank you. Obviously, a lot of loads coming here because this is like a big uh, shipping area, I guess. Perfect. Let's just park it. We're going to unload it ourselves here. Not unload it, but... How am I supposed to do this? Is this even possible? No, there's no way we're going to get it that way. Like this. Spin around, I guess. Yeah, there we go. This is the only way. But we're too far. We're going to poke out too far. And we're going to have to cut the wheel. Alright. This should might. This might do it. No, we're not going to make that. Our one, perfect. Man, that was close. Let's just try our best to push it, like... Is 
Oopsies. All right, let's back this up one more time here. Now let's cut the wheel this way again, see if we can get it straight. There we go. That's it right there, I guess. All right, now we're going to put a neutral, and we made this job. We got it done, boys and girls. So, we 16000 we lost no money. We made $20,696. We're level 15, which is an uh, entre entre entrepreneur. Perfect. Let's see what we have here. 30%. That's pretty good. Fragile cargo, just-in-time delivery, long distance. And we're going to we're going to go with fragile cargo. Perfect. Anyways, oh, let's see the upgrades. All right. Kenworth Stars and Stripes, Checkered Flag, Bumper Tactical, Tactical Bumper, Hot Flames, Blue Streak, this is probably, yeah, that's for the GTM or whatever. Alright, anyways, let's go to the trailer upgrades available. Um, just some trailer stuff right here. Alright, 53, alright, anyways, guys, hope you guys did enjoy, if you did, make sure to leave a like, reloved it, make sure to subscribe, thanks for watching, guys, have a good one, take it easy, and peace. I have to wait for the game to close because... Alright, bye guys. See you guys.